Hey everyone, this is Rafa. In this video, we're going to talk about how to export datasets in Team Center using PLM XML administration application. So what is PLM XML export import administration? This is an application in Team Center which is mostly used by Team Center administrators to migrate data between Team Center and other applications. You can use PLM XML import export administration to create your own transfer modes and uh, you can also define your closure rules, property sets and action rules in your custom transfer mode. So let's go ahead and export data sets using out of the box transfer mode. The traditional way of exporting data set is just right click on the data set, name references, click on the data set and you can download that and you can give the path wherever you want to download. So I'm going to show you how to export multiple data sets at one instance. So I have a data set here, a solid edge assembly, a PDF, a JT file and a PDF. Now I'm going to show you how to export these data sets using PLM XML export. So click on tools, go to export, click on to PLM XML now you have many transfer modes here. I want you to select configured data files export default. So this is going to export your physical data sets. If you choose this transfer mode, this is going to export only metadata. But if you choose this configured data files export default, this is going to export your metadata and your data sets. You can give your export directory. So my export directory is pointed to the desktop and export folder. You can leave this export file name as default if you want. Let's click on OK to export the data sets. So it's going to take a few seconds. It depends upon how many data sets you have to export. You can see the progress down which shows export in progress. The export completed successfully. Do you want to view log file for more details? I'll click S for this time. You can click no and close this session, but I'm going to show you how's the export summary looks like. So here's the export summary. You can see I have one solid edge assembly and I have two PDFs and I have four IMAN files and one direct a JD file. And you can see the overall summary here. I'm closing this. So let's go back to my folder. So this is where I pointed to export the data sets. So this is the XML here and let's go into this folder. So you can see all my data sets are exported to a folder and you can share this file to anyone if you want. I hope you start using a PLM XML export, you know, when, when you want to export multiple data sets. That's it for the today guys. And let me know if you have any questions in the comment section. If you like this video, please do like, share and subscribe. Stay safe. Peace.